All right, got something in the mail. And it's coming from China. I don't know what it is. <laughs> We're always getting random shit. Uh, this is Andre's. This shit took forever. Really? Okay. Well, this is his package, so. Nothing from law. So I got a few uh, Savage shirts to box up and take to the post office. Today is Friday shipping day. Oh, bad lighting. But um, here's one of my son's shirts. If you don't know about his uh, line, he is 10 years old. And this is hashtag. Oh, this one doesn't have the hat. Oh, here it is. Hashtag, oh, I'm thinking of the um, sweatshirts. The sweatshirts don't have the hashtag on the sleeve. So it's hashtag TBNR. And um, TBNR stands for the best never rest. And that's basically whatever you do in life. And uh, we also have Savage shirts. Savage tees and uh, tanks. The name of the company is the Kojo. That's my son's last name. So I'm very proud of him. We're doing uh, pretty steady right now. Um, not banging like I want to because I haven't been pushing it. Um, but that, I've got some projects that I completed uh, this week. And next on the hit list is the Kojo. So we're going to be at some bodybuilding shows, at some booths and things of that nature. I'm going to start off in the state first. And I'm thinking about possibly the Arnold. Arnold's boots are very expensive, but um, hey, it is what it is. I'm, I want to get this out there and not just to the bodybuilding community. You know what I'm saying? You know, you could be a savage in anything you do and also uh, TBNR. So go check out the website. I'm going to put that plug in, the Kojo, C -O -J -O -E dot com, and check them out. All right, y'all. See you in a bit. Man, I just got crazy blessed. Let me tell you this. I wasn't even going to go in this particular mu music store because there was two of them that my son's school recommended and I went to the one a little bit closer than mine. So once I told the guy that my son went to his school, he was like, wow, my child goes there too, second year. And I'm like, what? That dude, man, he hooked me up, man. You talk about a blessing. I saved all kinds of money. I mean, seriously. Um, I walked out of there and he just winked at me. He was like, Woo! Wow! God is good, man. You better know it. Puts people in your path sometimes when you don't even really expect it. I had planned on shelling out some serious cash today for this alto sax and, um, brand new alto sax, too. Um, I, we decided to rent it, and um, even the rent pay, down payment was crazy, but he waived that, and to do a little bit of work before I pick up a little man and go to one of my favorite restaurants, sit in the corner. I think I'm going to have a margarita and uh, do some of this work for my uh, online clients and also uh, one of my clients that I saw today. I need to change up her diet and um, actually two of them I saw today. I tell you, 
blessings are just coming. They're just coming. Um, when, you're, when you don't even expect it and you get a blessing, it's almost like, I know I just spoke on it, but I'm, I'm kind of dumbfounded right now and really just like, thank you. I mean, I... I didn't even really know what to say, but thank you. I think I've said I said it maybe 18 times, and he was like, "Like I got you, I got you." So, I want to reiterate that again because I'm thankful, you know, because I had some other things to do, and now I'm able to do those other things. So, um, yeah, I don't really have anything planned this weekend except for training clients. You know, I've been kind of boring lately. I haven't really been doing too much. Um, I need a fucking vacation. I do. I need a vacation. I need to go away by myself. I really want a vacation just me. And I want to go somewhere on a beach and just chill. I don't want to talk. I just want to chill. So that's going to be something that is um, in the works towards the end of the year or possibly the beginning of the year. Um, I got to do a fast because the uh, City Limits Championships is coming up soon in April. And I'm going to be working on that today a little bit too. So just wanted to say a quick whatever. totally mad because something is going on with his snapchat I'm trying to watch the Olympics right now my favorite portion of the Olympics is track and um, I'm crazy excited right now so I'm not gonna say I'm gonna be here until the women come on but um, I've been here doing some work and uh, it's, it's just what I do I'm, I'm relaxed when I come here. The restaurant is called Real Mamba. This particular one is on Cooper Street, Arlington, Texas. So check them out. There's another one that I go to on Ballpark. And uh, hey, it is what it is. So I love to get my work done here. I like to have a nice margarita. And the company is fabulous. And hey, it is what it is. He's mad. He got locked out of Snapchat. I don't know what's going on. Maybe there's something going on with Snapchat. Huh? 
shit. I can't help him. I'm not a snap tap. Snap tap. Snap tap. <laughs> I'm not a snap tap. Do IG. Savior. Did they? Oh, replay. Replay on this hoe. Look at that shit. Do they train in Colorado? What the fuck? Bam. The one right after her, she like, she was gone. Right here. She was Yes. Look at her hair! Look at her hair! Her hair is just rolling. Go, girl! Damn! Oh my God! Look at that! It don't make no sense. Oh my God! I would have pulled a hamstring. But that Jamaican was on that ass. Well, I don't really turn up. My son told me that I was boring and that I should go out, but I just don't want to go out. I'd rather just have nice meals, <laughs> go shopping, and spend some time with him. And he doesn't want to spend time with me, but it's all good. But I'm just chilling on a Saturday. We're here seeing our girl. Helen, wave. Yeah, on my YouTube. I'm putting you on my YouTube. Hey guys, how are y'all today? Tell them where you are and to come on out. Uh, I'm at Rio Mambo, South Cooper, in Arlington, Texas. Come out today. We have happy hour until 7 p.m. And we also have salsa night tonight. Um, no cover. Have some drinks. <laughs> and our uh, little party DJ, live music, gonna be awesome. Awesome. Premium liquor. Not, we don't have that cheap shit here. We got nice liquor. Yeah. Can't you see? I mean, we have organic liquor too. <laughs> organic. Shit. The hell? Organic tap right there for all those people and Brett. Oh my god. That'll get you no fucked hungover. up. No, it won't get you. You won't hang over because on that it's, shit. Because it's organic and it has an official organic stamp. For all those really? people in Oh my God, really? How come I don't it's get that? It's the golden ticket. Look at it, Dre. It's gold. <laughs> Think about it. You and me, I and you. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all heard it. it. I need to taste it. Hell yeah. I never heard about this organic shit. You know, I, I just drink my uh, iguana. Oh shit. Damn, this gonna set me over the edge. God, dog it. Why? What the fuck? It's strong, ain't it? It's not? It's organic. It's organic. Nothing organic. <laughs> no. You're good? <laughs> Shit. What's your name, Dre? Eee, Dre. <laughs> Shit. I just got about five chest hairs. <laughs> Oh, maybe I don't six. Think I want to hear story. <laughs> <laughs> I felt them. It went poop, 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 poop. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know if I could do she that. Say though. hi. Dre, you want to say hi? <laughs> okay, y'all are going to be on my YouTube. So. Okay, so this is your five minutes of fame right here. <laughs> <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> Eric keeps calling in. All right, y'all. Well, we won't be here today. It's an hour wait, so we're like totally out of here.
<laughs> About to get in. Go in real hard. You too. Bye, little man. Bye. Uh oh. <laughs> Bye. I haven't had oatmeal in quite some time. It's been probably two months. What happened was I fixed some oatmeal protein pancakes and I don't know what happened, but it made me throw up profusely. I mean, it was terrible. So I'm really afraid. <laughs> I'm afraid of this oatmeal right now, but I'm gonna try it. Hopefully I'll be all right. Two minutes in the microwave and we're gonna see. All right, y'all. This is scary. I want to put a little bit of um, Molly McButter and some little squirt. Make it a little bit sweet. Not much at all. I'm scared. I love oatmeal, but Lord. And if I throw up, I'm not going to let y'all see it. I mean, seriously. Ooh. Let's see how much I can stomach. I'm going to have some egg whites too. But, um, since then, I haven't had any pancakes. I went to this wonderful place um, out here. They had chicken and waffles. And to be honest with you, I had about maybe three bites of that waffle. It was just, you know, I don't know what's going on with that carb situation. That type of carb. I can eat rice all day, but um, I'm really, really afraid of uh, oatmeal and pancakes even the smell of it well we won't get into that but so far so good i think i did good that's gonna be it next i'm gonna have my shot of probiotic juice it's a pomegranate flavor. Pretty good. I'll do that once a day.